Hello all, today I am going to introduce you to Test Manager and in that we are going to create the manual project from scratch. So first let me introduce you the icons on the QTest that you must be required to know. So this is the project, sample project where all project will be listed and in that whatever the project you have you can navigate through that. So for now I only have a sample project so I can just see only one project but in future you may see multiple projects. In that there will be the release whatever the release you have you can create by using the release new release. There is a two way to create a new release. This one is the first and here you can go and create new release. So as you can see we already created the release 1, release 2, release 3. And how we can create that will be going to see in upcoming videos. This is the build. Whatever the release you have, there will be the multiple requirements. So you can you can see you can right click and create new build. And there is a two way as well to create new build. This one and this one. Whatever you prefer, you can go through that. This is a recycle bin. Whatever you will be delete, that will be going to recycle bin. This is a filter for test plan and this is a toggle, toggle button. Toggle button use for the if you want to IDs for the release then you can see. If you want to the IDs for build you, that you can select as per your preference. And you can see the test plan. Test plan is by default for the all the project. There is a requirement, design, test execution and defect. These are the settings you can just go through that but for now as a fresher you don't need to look into that and notification whatever the notification you you will be doing here that will be displayed uh, like uh, suppose you are in a one project there is a five members five members using the same credentials or same same project then then they can see the notification what uh, first member is doing if he deleted the test cases then notification will be there not with the same same credentials but but uh, in same project and the search whatever the things you want you can search and this is the profile this is the parameters as a fresher you no need but how we can create the parameter we will look into the upcoming videos as well that be the most of the use of the lead manager all things that you that you all things you can see that most of the use by the manager and lead so this is all about the all about this so let's meet in upcoming videos stay tuned thank you so much